it was wrong Guess you got all you wanted Yeah, I don't know why suddenly you're gone You'll never be forgotten Pretending no one is to blame Too late to reignite our flame How did I not see you running? How did I get behind? How did I not see this coming? Guess all you left me running Real Madrid team, 4-3-3 as always, and as we mentioned before, it's as close to their strongest team as you'll get, perhaps the exception being Nacho. Remember, he and Sergio Ramos have played 300 minutes over the course of a week, that included the extra time against Bayern Munich uh, in the Champions League quarter-final second leg. Uh, the famous trio now, they could be a legendary trio, close Modric and uh, Casemiro, and of course the BBC up front. And whenever they start a game, uh, they do not lose in La Liga this season. The last time we did was actually against Real Madrid in that 4-0 that we reminded you of uh, just a couple of moments ago. Um, Barcelona's 4-3-3. Um, and we mentioned just the one change. Our captain in for Neymar. What is the key for them? Is it attitude? Is it to do with the way they knit play together to recover and rediscover feeling? I think Jerry was mentioned that earlier. Without the ball, if they're actually able to uh, recover early, that's where the danger is, of course, because with the space, uh, you know, Messi and Luis Suarez and all that. Let's hand you over to your commentary team. It's a very good evening to Jerry Armstrong and Rob Pump. Thank you, David. Well, they tell us this is the most watched game of football ever. 185 countries all dipping into El Gran Clasico. <laughs> Two teams who are sep separated historically, but in La Liga, separated by three points. <laughs> every view covered the further bow this evening. It is said that this is Luis Enrique, as he's known Lucho, his last. It could be the game that defines how he's remembered as the Barcelona manager. Seven majors he's won. He's in the cup final this season. He could do the double again, as he's done the treble, but lose today. And effectively, they are now to the reckoning 
for La Liga. When picked up at the end of Rafa Benitez, Stabby had all kinds of problems. Benzema and Cobb have missed six games. Bale was drafted in, they have problems, but they are at full strength and they're a team at the moment. The big call for the referee, Ronaldo goes down. There are about 90,000 witnesses all claiming that he's been fouled. Right. Let's see this again. Here it comes. He gets across from TT. Well, let's see. Oh, he gets it there. He doesn't get the ball. It's a penalty. The referee was arching his neck to see it. Ronaldo playing the. Messi, you can't pin him down to a position. Jordi Alba. Suarez is hung deep. Ooh. Whistles one out. It's a chance, Rob. Good strike. Just wide of the left hand post. And again, entered with his formation, playing three at the back. No room for experimentation tonight against Real Madrid. Messi, oh, gets past Casemiro. To watch his step tonight, Casemiro. That's his job to stop the flow in midfield of the referee. A yeah, very early booking. That's dangerous. He doesn't need to get. That's one of the things he needs to improve on for me. That's up. He's walking now, and he doesn't remind. He doesn't really need to do that early on. He's only on the halfway line. Referee's no choice in to give him a yellow card. Well, he's lost possession. Casemiro to Kroos. Marcelo. Ronaldo with some work space. Benzema fighting for a position in the centre. Ronaldo, a big hand from Ter Stegen. It was important because not only did he stop it, he had to batter it away from Benzema, who was waiting for any spillage. Well, this oh, is not good. Oh, no. Look at this. A little messy is down. That's not a sight you want to see for any footballer. Oh, Maybe the dentist uh, rather than the physio that they require. Well, let's see what happens when he comes in here. Does he catch an arm, an elbow? What is it? He's holding his face. Oh, he catches the elbow. Marcelo looks like an axe ball, but it catches him plumb in the face. Looks like his mouth or teeth here. He jumps to get out of the way. Yeah, he's going to have to go up because yeah. there is a spillage of blood. He's got a graze on the arm as well. If he caught him with the elbow on the teeth, that, that could be where the graze is coming. <laughs> yeah. This looks like the face. I have a tooth embedded in the elbow. In the corner. Ter Stegen fighting. Zoman Piquet. Marcelo. Ter Stegen stays. It's Ramos. It's the post. Scrambled over the line. It's an unlikely hero. Casemiro. Maybe an ugly goal, but a goal of great beauty in the eyes of those Real Madrid supporters. Yeah, it's his fourth goal, Rob. He scored already this season, but. You can see when the cross comes in from Marcelo, they've not been good defending uh, from Barcelona over the last couple of months, I have to say. It's put in deep the far coast. There's two Real Madrid players going for it. And you watch the corner coming in, punched partially clear outside the box. But then look at this. The marking is awful. Far post. Well, the question is, offside. was it offside? Yeah. It I'm was Ramos who will get the assist. And Ramos hit the post. I'm not sure if he was offside. There was other players moving out who looked offside. I don't know if Casemiro was one of them. But it's counted, it's a goal. And Ramos hits it off the post and he's got Cristiano Ronaldo behind him looking to get on it as well. And there you go, top end for Casemiro. In a couple of years' time, that might be one that goes to the video assistant referee. Casemiro wasn't waiting around to see if there was a flag man. He was celebrating. Well, we'll leave that to game and give it in. Thierry discuss if they can see it at half time. Rakitic. Leaves it for Messi. Messi full steam ahead. Brilliant, oh, brilliant, brilliant. Lionel Messi. Hasn't scored in six Classicos, but he's back to haunt Real Madrid. Cut and thrust. Absolutely superb. Well, he's on his 46th goal now, Rob. 
And the little man does what he does best. Clever play. Combination, lovely little one-two. Acceleration into the box. And an absolutely top drawer finish. Well, one for the history books as well, because this is the goal that puts him ahead of everybody else as the scorer in Classicos. One more now than the great De Stefano. Look at his first touch coming in here. He looks like he's lost it there to Carvajal. He goes past him in a flash. Look at the body swerve. The great balance, and then he slots it past the goalkeeper. Fabulous goal from Lionel Messi. My goodness. Four hundred and ninety-nine goals in Lionel Messi's career. Well, was, they're not as fluent going forward. But... Oh, it's close games. Two additional minutes to the first half. Brilliant ball from Suarez. Messi waiting for Rakitic to make the move. But Rakitic doesn't have that turbo charge. Messi does. Collides with Casemiro again. The referee felt that was the immovable of. Lost. <laughs> chance. You don't think they're trying to give a off any chance because everybody, PK, Sergio Roberto, all come surging forward trying to get him sent off. And let's see it again. He comes across. That's a far. He could easily have booked them for that. And that's why I said the first foul was a silly one. I think if he hadn't already booked them for a yellow card, he'd have given him a yellow card there. And it could quite easily have been a second yellow card. Messi thinks so. He's passing out his first corner of the game. The final play of the first half. Rakitic right across the face of goalkeepers missing. Oh, what an escape from Kayla Navas. Little Messi very rarely misses chances like that. Yeah, there's a foul there. You can see Suarez falls on top of Navas as he goes to get a touch with your own Messi. That was an opportunity. I can't believe he's missed it. <laughs> Asensio. The replacement for Gareth Bale. Sensio continues the run. Benzema on the outside. Oh, Benzema can't get there. So that was because I am not Kelly Modi. Give it to Bolun. Pull back to pull back. Marcelo. He's had an excellent week. I mean, he's been captured with Rakitic. Swinger from Cross. Marcelo makes it. An excellent run. Benzema's in there. Oh, what a save by Ter Stegen. Cutting reflexes from the German. Yeah, pure reflexes, Rob. You're spot on. He can't believe it. Karim Benzema cannot believe Jordi Alba. Rakitic touch. Alcacer's big chance. And Kayla Navas to Real Madrid's rescue. What a chance. Alba. Watch. That's interesting. Benzema. Right, it's the youngster. So he's got a big chance here. Pass it on to Ronaldo. He wants the ground to swallow him up with the whole world watching. Wow, wow. Doesn't miss many like that normally. Cristiano Ronaldo. What a great piece of play on the front of the back. Karim Benzema. Marco Asensio shows that pace. I was telling you, he's got Rob. Lovely turn of pace. He outstrips everybody. Puts it in front. Well, it's slightly behind, but he should have hit the target. <laughs> Iniesta, oh, and now the Suarez. Wow. Shot class once more from Kayla Navas. Tony Cross is just sliding a bit for me, Rob. I don't know if he's run out of steam. That's around. Casemiro Messi. The one man who's standing between Barcelona and a goal at the moment. Messi gets stuck in. This is Kovacic, who brings a different dimension to the run of red midfield. Asensio playing the Gareth Bale role. Ronaldo makes an angle for him, Asensio! Oh, went for the angle wow. to surprise him. So Stegen follows rule number one of goalkeeping, never get yeah, yeah, beaten in the the Patience pays off! And you can see what it means to Luis Enrique. He's hit the dead and very, very under the boot. The crowd here at the Bernabeu. He's the eighth goal of the season, Rob. That's his best goal of the season, I'll tell you. That's going to keep the league tight ahead. 
comes from nothing, inside on his left foot, looking for the far corner, absolute superb. Curling it with his left foot, that's brilliant. Oh, take a bow, Rakitic. 2-1 to Barcelona, and the league title is still up for grabs. We have Liga. Well, he was perfection. He had to be. So he's to sneak it past Kayla Navas, who has been in world-class form. <laughs> Luis Enrique leaps off the bench <laughs> like he scored a goal in a Clásico, which he has done, of course. It's the only place it can go in. Absolute top draw. There's a disconsolate. Navas, Ronaldo, but they've got 17 minutes left to see. Rock like to get up Barcelona. Oh, it's a it's one of those tackles where Ramos had committed himself to the ball. Oh, the straight red. Ramos oh, is off. Goodness. Well, the referee didn't even consider that. He turned it. He was about to speed past him, but Ramos had committed himself. And for the second season in a row, Sergio Ramos is sent off against Barcelona and by the same referee. Well, he has these rash moments, Rob, and he has thrown himself in. My first thoughts were it was probably a yellow, but... Let's have a look, see. Oh. Oh. Yeah. I think he's right because he does go in two-footer, Rob. He's every right to set him off. That's a two-footer. That's a really rash challenge. And if he well, makes proper contact, he, he could have broke his leg. I did my best, Jerry, to play devil's advocate, but that's a yellow. That's a red yeah, there's no defence for Sergio Ramos. When you see it in slow motion, and you'll see the referee was in the frame of the picture as well. He had a good view. He gave himself half a second to think about it. Sergio Ramos is dismissed. Halle Mini is hard to make a two foot a challenge near to the ball. I'll take the rugby at any choice. I'll tweet you later. Ramos and PK do have a social media presence together. Those gets to Gomez. Oh, brilliant ball by Suarez. Andre Gomez. PK's in the centre forward position. PK! Kayla Navas keeps this game alive. He's been a menacing for them. Messi! Kayla Navas, game. Tony Cross. Marcel. It's with hope. Brilliant run! Oh my goodness! It is James Rodriguez, who does write his name in the history books. Well, you said it wrong two minutes ago. Ten man Real Madrid, five minutes to go. And he gets in at the near post and puts it in. That's a fabulous goal. It's his seventh goal of the season for James Rodriguez. And I don't think he's going to score a more important goal than that. Really massive, massive goal for Real Madrid. PK wants to get on it. Well, Tony Cruz's ball is good, but the ball and the run is even better. Nobody picking him up. He comes from the far post position, Rob. And nobody picks him up for Real Madrid or for Barcelona. He's run. At least eight or nine yards on mark, and he slots it in past Ter Stegen. Oh, if only Barcelona could defend. And you think of the saves Ter Stegen's already made in this game to keep them in the match. Oh, wonderful goal. What we were saying, quite often Zinedine Zidane makes a change, which isn't often. There's Arsenio. It's the youngest man on the pitch. Asensio! Oh. Ter Stegen. Still a slow kicks it out, it's still in play. The danger won't go, go. Asensio's in there! Oh, and Ronaldo had a chance to win it. 